Hello everyone. Um, today I wanted to show you a little thing I invented or I figured out and that is a way to move blocks in one direction using the new slime block mechanics. So we, I will just start up that clock here and we will see what it does. Um, <laughs> no, it's not glitchy. <laughs> yeah. Um, it will just pull blocks over there really quickly and then they will fall down um, on the other side but on the way my Minecraft just crashed. Well, <laughs> see you in a bit. So we're back and <laughs> I don't know what just happened when Minecraft crashed so maybe it maybe had something to do with those visual glitches which duplicate like you saw some blocks duplicated there. That's just a visual glitch, they're not actually duplicating. <laughs> actually was a post on the Minecraft Reddit which was like, ooh, like dupli block duplicating machine duplicating diamonds, but yeah, it's not actually duplicating the block and maybe that had something to do with the game crashing, but maybe you shouldn't just have this run at, at <laughs> um, like two tick, at a two tick clock. I you have run I usually run run it in my experience um with a four tick clock like like that so yeah. It's a lot more manageable but sometimes the block dupes blocks dupe anyway. So this is actually a block which doesn't exist. And oops, <laughs> I fell right through. Yeah it's it's not there anymore. So oh actually been demonstrated this also works in like different directions. I can move blocks down, I could move blocks up. Um, the big problem will always be what do you do with the blocks at the end of the end of this thing. Um, like it's easy with sand blocks, they just fall down, but here you would have to um, add another piston for example, another sticky piston. Uh, right here to pull to pull the blocks, um, add that to the timing and something like that. That was actually really lucky, believe me or not. <laughs> um, and then you could like deal with them. But yeah, yeah, that is not. Yeah, I don't know. I'm not gonna bother with that until I know that there's a practical application for this and I'm pretty sure there isn't a practical application for this. But it looks cool, so I made this thing over here where I just hooked up a bunch of them um, to a big stack of sand and gravel and red sand to get some color in, into the build. Um, and yeah, the timing here is I have one for four clock and then just for uh, the repeaters with the lead delay of four though that just transfers the signal in a way that I've it works as if I had a lot of four four clocks and I don't have to build that clock all over again and I can just start it once and everything would work and yeah a kind of a flaw with this is because I'm not actually using blocks and uh, clocks <laughs> I'm using blocks it's Minecraft um, because I'm not actually using clocks over here and so they'll actually have the same problem over here that they will both be powered or both be off and if that's the case sometimes they will when I start them they will push the block backwards first and that is why there are some blocks lying right here which got pushed backwards when I started this thing but yeah when it's running it, it works fine and right here I'm just transporting things from a stack of sand of blocks down to, to void, they're falling into the void here, you can't really see. And yeah, sometimes if, if I, I've experimented here and some of them stacked up, um, I, I experimented with faster timings and no, it's not really working with faster timings. Maybe with three three ticks, but not with, definitely not with two ticks. And with one ticks, it completely bugs out. Yeah, this is <laughs> just in case you're wondering. This is an infinite stack. It's it's not gonna end. It's just gonna like get get generated. And I'm I'm trying to use um, 
slime locks mechanics because they really make some things easier. I mean, I, I could have just used a fill command, but no, I'm I'm gonna use six set blocks commands. It was easier to set up and and a lot of slime blocks and it, it's it's nice. Um, so yeah, it looks very funny. Maybe you can do something with it. Maybe it's useful to you. If it is, like, tell me because I really want to know. But for now, that's that's it with this design and this video. So yeah, see you around. <laughs>